Hey guys, the Chickens here. We are back today with another Ruby video. In today's video, guys, we crushed it. We got up to rank 18 and some change. And we're gonna go over exactly what we did uh, to get there. And man, it got dirty really fast today. So guys, what we, what we need to focus on right now um, is being able to survive four engine rooms. So we're gonna show you some attack strategies that are gonna be able to do that for you. But <clears throat> the takeaway, essentially progress is going to be impossible. Um, the ba the attacks are going to come down to, you know, zero engine room clearing and 50%, um, just like this, you know, I, I won 17 stars on this, zero engines cleared, 3% destruction, beat them, yay, chicken. So, a lot of them are like that, uh, when I was pushing earlier, um, but look at this, he didn't get one, 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 so I mean, obviously this base is really sweet if you have all this stuff with it. Um, damage Ant, Rocket Launcher, Shock Blaster, Boom Mines, uh, that's going to be the extras. And then the rest of it, everyone should already have. So, in terms of tech, you know, you're thinking, Chicken, what do I do now? How do I get out of this? How do I survive here? So, either you, you beat them or you join them. So, you either match the defensive tech and you go for the minimal clearing percentage, or 1 ER or whatever. But, our ticket out of 4 ER hell is actually right here. It's the shock bomb. So once we get the shock bomb, cluster bases aren't going to be an issue. Once there's no more cluster bases, then we can go back to fully clearing or at least grabbing two or three engines per match. So that's where we want to get to next. That's what um, that's what we have loaded up right now. And let's go over... Um, I'll go over a good attack first. This was good technically since we won. But uh, this guy's got launchers. He's got rockets at tick four. The only thing he's missing is the damage amp. So... <clears throat> the drop's essentially the same. One rifle on the bottom, uh, doodlers in behind, and then just smoke the riflemen as uh, they become in range of the critter launchers. That's going to um, protect them and divert the critter launchers to shoot at something else. Um, and then from that point, <clears throat> just delay drop the rifles. You don't really do anything. You delay drop the rifles, uh, put in second win, and smoke them once they get close. Um, if they have max rockets or if they have tick four rockets with the damage amp, um, like I do, then I wouldn't actually, um, do it like this because you're just going to, uh, fizzle really quickly, especially if the, if the bombardiers are wide open to the rocket launchers, um, they're going to get melted very fast. So what you can, we can do there instead, which we'll probably match up with some here, um, is we can just smoke and go for one engine room, either with riflemen or, uh, with rifles or bombers. Uh, we'll show you a couple different ways that we can do that, but it's gonna get tough, man. It's gonna get tough for the next little bit. Um, I wish they'd give us some extra troop health or something to just, I don't know. <clears throat> I find like super like crazy fizzle metas like this, and I know the title of the season is Rough Seas. Um, they're just not fun. They're just annoying, <laughs> especially with the critter launchers that are already so amazingly strong. Um, but I refuse to get them. I refuse to get them. I, I don't like crashing people's games. I don't like people losing my base because of, um, you know, things like that. So I want to go the the better route and, and go with rockets. Plus, I think it's going to get us to shock bombs faster. Everyone that's got critter launchers, they're going to be, uh, they're going to be really vying for, uh, I didn't mean to do that. Uh, they're going to be really hoping to get, what was I saying? Uh, they're going to really be hoping to get the shock bomb sooner and later. Because <clears throat> you need the rockets. You don't necessarily need the critter launchers, but you need the rockets. And we're going to need those shock bombs ASAP. All right, so uh, this one, what we're going to do is we're going to clear, and then we're going to go for one ER, okay? And that engine room we're going to go for. I'm not really sure which one just yet. I also have critters. Um... You see what I mean there? Those rockets are just packing a punch. Thankfully, we've got a lot of second wins left, so not the end of the world, but yeah. Here's what we can do. We can open some stuff up with the critters, and then we can just go for it. Okay. And let's go. Let's go right about now. I think I'm going to go... Something like that. Let's get one more second wind out. And let's see. We got the flare up. <clears throat> got everybody in front. Smoke coming up. We need two shots with those doodlers. Maybe three. 
Yeah, there we go. All right, so right there, we got some percentage. We're gonna go ahead and retreat. We got a lot of percentage and we got one engine down. So that's gonna be tough to beat because these guys, they're all going, they're all going to Fizzletown. Now he was close, he was close. He's also got, it looks like he's got pretty high level critters right there. Um, but that shouldn't be enough to get the job done. But my god, look at that. There we go. There it is. So there's the dub, guys. There's the dub. Um, and that's how we're going to want to want to do it. The reason that's working right now is because nobody else knows to do that just yet. Um, everyone's still trying to full clear it or, and, you know, realizing that we're in a pretty bad fizzle meta. All right, so we got rockets. We got the same thing. So we're going to do the same thing we just did. Um, yeah. So we're just chilling at first. It's just an easy free clear. Get into range. Don't lose Kavon. Um, and then we want to do... I find the smoke works better because, um, <clears throat> you know, if you get caught by a machine gun or something like that, you just don't have a lot of time. It's not easy to do. It's definitely not easy to do, so... Um, okay. <clears throat> okay, at least he doesn't have critter launchers. And let's go like that. Use Try to use these critters. Let's see how well these work at level 1. Not great. Not terrible, I guess. Alright, come on, rifles. I need somebody to get in front here for me. Alright, so we're going like that. And I think we're going to do the same thing here in just a second. Alright, we got enough in front. Two, three. Okay. Ah, I was late on the critters. That smoke threw me off. Might not get this one. No. Shoot. But we got some percentage. Probably would have got more if I just uh, stayed the course, but let's see. Oh my god, he went for it. <laughs> let's go. Let's go. This is what it is, guys. This is what it is. But the problem is it's going to get really difficult uh, to collect chests doing this. What was the what was the plan there? Oh, he's using warriors. Good night. <laughs> oh, my God. Poor Sinus. Um, but, yeah. So that's basically it, guys. That's basically it. That's the highest I think I've been yet today. Um, or close to it. So we're moving back up in the right direction. Where are we at now on the global? Top 250-ish, ish, ish, ish. There's one, there's two, 35, yeah, 233. So we're making moves, there's Shishki. We're making moves, guys, but um, but yeah, so I, I hope that helps you out, and it's just about survive for right now. If you don't have Kavon, that's a good pickup. Um, you're gonna need Kavon. If you don't have flares, you're also gonna kinda need flares. So, <clears throat> yeah. I'd get those two things, then we want to go to Shock Bomb. That's going to be our ticket out of this. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope you found it helpful. Um, make sure to subscribe to the channel. Use the code CHICKEN in the shop. And we'll see you in the next one. Chicken out. Back, back.